painting of a gothic castle. Artist unknown, circa 1920s. Oil on canvas, 20 by 28. Miss Franklin, where did you say you got this? Oh, I inherited it a few months ago. But it's been in my family for generations. The composition is so unusual. And the artist used pure colors straight from the tube and then varnished each layer over I'm, and over. I'm sorry for interrupting. But do I really need to be here? No, of course not. It's just that most people prefer to be at an appraisal, especially when they plan on selling the piece. It's just I'm, I'm kind of in a hurry. Say no more. Just sign at the bottom and you are free to go. Thank you. So how long do you think it'll take to sell it? Well, I'll need to see ownership records before I can do anything. I'll send you everything I have. So is it all then? Um, no. Since you definitely want to sell the piece, I'll need to confirm its authenticity, its physical condition. So if you'll just sign at the bottom, that will let us go ahead and x-ray the piece. Done. Anything else? Um, well, yes, Miss Franklin. I would really like the time to research this. That way I can get you the best price. Look, I appreciate your professionalism. I really do. But I'm not interested in getting the best price. I just want you to sell that painting as soon as you can, all right? Good night, Miss Hallowell. Good night. It was an accident. It's not like I borrowed Prue's car so I could drive it into a pole. How bad's the damage? Not bad, but maybe expensive, which is why I need a favor. <laughs> if you're calling to borrow money, I don't have any. No, it's not about money. It's just, I don't want you to tell Prue. She's been so supportive, and I don't want to lose her trust again. You mean you haven't told her? Well, not yet, but I, I have a plan. Phoebe, you have to tell her. It's her car, and you don't have the money to fix it. But I will have the money to fix it. I'm at this company called Web San Francisco. It's an interactive network on the internet, and I faxed them my right, resume this morning, and they want to meet with me tonight. I've got to go, but Phoebe, I don't want to be in the middle of this. Just tell her, okay? If I don't get the job, I will tell her. Hello, I'm Phoebe Hallowell. I have an appointment. Thanks. All these people, they're here for the interview too, aren't they? Well, you won't have any trouble with this if you figured that out. It's an aptitude test. You can finish it at home. Great, great. So you won a fellowship from the National Science Foundation. When I was at Harvard, yeah. How'd you know? It's not on your resume. Mm -hmm. I was cum laude also, except I was a Ford Foundation scholar. So then you must have gone to Stanford? Stanford? I went to Stanford. Intimidating, isn't it? Like the Goodwill Huntings or this aptitude test? Well, who cares about linear algebra or differential? And that test is a snap. I mean, in this day and age, who can't write in the HTML and numeric languages, right? <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's for you. What?